Hey y'all, welcome back to the channel. As always, my name is Dave. Today happens to be an absolutely beautiful day down here in Dallas, Texas, and I've got to go visit a project of mine. So I figured why not do an architecture themed vlog video and show you guys the day in the life of an architect. First stop is gonna be an OAC meeting, an owner architect contractor meeting at a project of mine in Denton, Texas. That project is a big, big multifamily project. It's gonna be student housing uh, right across the street from a university up there. And right now it is coming out of the ground. We've got concrete done, they're doing podium levels, and it's what's called a wrap project or a Texas donut, basically a parking garage in the middle, and then wrapping around that is all the apartment units. So right now with that project, we got a lot going on. There's concrete work going, foundations getting laid, there's precast concrete structures getting put up. But first part is the meeting, and then we're gonna be touring the site, and we're gonna bring you guys along for that. Follow that up, we're gonna head back down to the office because I've got a lot of paperwork and detailed drawings that we need to do for this project. So the whole goal of today's video is to bring you guys along during a day in the life of an architect. I really hope you guys enjoy it. If you do, hit subscribe, hit that bell notification, and drop us a thumbs up, we appreciate that. But uh, you know what? We gotta get on the road, so let's get after it. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. You'll never have the sacred stone. <laughs> Oh, this you crazy mother... Alright, so we just got to the job site. I'm not going to be able to bring you guys into the meeting with us, but I just want you guys to take a look at what's going on here and flip you around. That is all the progress right now. They're working on pouring concrete and getting the podium levels up. So hopefully we'll be able to take you for a tour as well. Stay tuned. Yeah, you can see like the speed. I mean, when I got here, they were putting in that stair section. So it's Legos, man. It's just like, you know, yeah. you snap it down. And so that's all precast. That's not um, tilt wall, right? It's all, it's all precast. Not tilt wall. Yeah. Here, let's look at this guy. Credit to Nate and Puzzle. Uh, yeah. So all the penetrations from the units above and how it ultimately works with the systems, you know, there's no wide space. They went to town on that. They did a pretty good job of solving it. Right here? Yes. Um, I'm forgetting how the detail goes, but I think memory serves the so you have two ways of doing this. One is you've got the plate sitting above the slab, um, and then you you uh, put the the nuts on tight, right? Yeah. It's not really ideal because it doesn't work well with your framing, right? Because the the HSS that gets welded to it has to sit exactly within the, the framing, yeah. right? So the better way is the embed, so that you've got a clean plate. Right, with no protrusions above it, I mean, you just weld the HSS and yeah. it lines up with the frame wall. So, diving pieces up. The yeah. crane came in this way first. Pull up, get all the precast on the ramp, right? Um, and they're just, they're just stopping it all in place. 
So that, you get a sense also for like what's in our scope, like cast in place that we need to coordinate to be the tabletop for the precast, right? Yeah. So that's what all this is, and the precast just comes on top. Level one, right there. Okay. okay. So you can see like an example of the coordination Gerber had to do with precast and with JSC, like where we're sizing the openings for the fans. And then you can see the uh, corbel that the double T is going to sit on. So Jeff had to design that. Like that wasn't living in precast, right? So it's kind of like this, um, you got to kind of coordinate the system. So From that point up, is, is that going to be precast or? Yeah. So, so yeah. Okay. Yeah, you know, then that's obviously our retaining cost. So this thing moves so fast. And here we have, we have units. Or is this going to be retail? I can't remember if that's retail or wrap. So, right, it's going to be this right here. Okay. This is kind of a double height space right here. Yeah. There's going to be units above. And then this is like a little, uh, this is going to be like a little uh, that's the, uh, staircase, you know. Okay. So, Nate. From right about here down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. This is, this is going to be like an open air parking type thing. Uh, even here, though. But, uh, the more of a thing, it said to avoid the street path, but, yeah. Right? So it happens. You can see the horrible side. It's actually the lift and rotate and the fix. Just sit. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. This is the access to your level one of um, parking structure. So you can see here. You can see you can see the wall. Uh, they leave out the wall where the stairs are gonna go. Yeah. So come up. There's the retail columns. I didn't see any. Again, I didn't see any embeds in the column. You can post and solid post and solid. If you want to just climb up, take a look, see what they're doing. Yeah. Why not? You go straight back to the office? Yeah. All right, I'll see you there. All right, guys, that was a site visit. Hope you enjoyed it. We're gonna head back to the office now.
Okay, so we're back in the office right now, and we're reviewing a stack of waterproofing details. So basically, we have a third-party consultant. Uh, they review our drawing set to make sure that our building is going to be watertight, and we want to make sure it's as watertight as possible. And so they came back with a bunch of recommendations. It's going to take me a couple of days to get started, get through all of this. But what I'm doing now is going through all this paperwork and applying it into our drawing set. Super fun. No one ever said the life of an architect was super glamorous. It's a lot of paperwork and hanging out in the office. Okay, and there you go. That's it for today. We're gonna take off. It's been a long day, and I've got some other stuff to do tonight. That's my office right there. The ground button. It is 7.30. It's been a long day. Ready to get home. Hey, there you guys are. Come on with me. There you go. We were just right up there on the 31st floor. Now we are headed back to my place to call it a night.